We welcome you to our meaningful meditation for the second Sunday of Lent. We are grateful to be outside as we greet the new month of March. We're thinking about our text for this Sunday is actually coming from the Gospel of John and we'll be in chapter three. This is the story of Nicodemus going to Jesus at nighttime and asking Jesus some questions about being born again. It's kind of a, a text that can be really confusing. The part that we will especially be focusing on is this whole idea of asking questions. That's the series theme of our Seeking Honest Questions to a Deeper Faith. And many of the scholars, when you read about this text, are asking why Nicodemus felt it was important to go to ask his questions of Jesus at night. And there's all different theories, uh, one of them being that he was very fearful of what other religious leaders would think about Nicodemus as a religious leader going and talking to this kind of rebel uh, teacher in Jesus. And we're going to unpack what it is like to have some questions about our faith and that often we will have fear and wondering if we really can be honest with what we're thinking about who Christ is, who God is for us in our life, and having the, the courage and loving ourselves enough to know that God welcomes our questions. For many people uh, who may have grown up in the church and were told that they couldn't ask questions to just always believe without questioning. And really the point of our theme for Lent is how much deeper our faith is when we can be authentic and true to where we're feeling uh, our journey is going with Christ. And so this is a safe place at University of Presbyterian to come and to ask those questions and to really think together about what it means to be a person of faith in this 2023 as we seek to be the church together. So continue to encourage you to read your devotional. If you don't have one yet, you can still pick one up in the office or over in the church. You can also read them online and uh, coming up a week from Sunday is daylight savings time when we spring ahead. So just want to remind you uh, to put that on your calendar so that you'll be not uh, too early for church. And we're grateful so much for the opportunity we have to continue also to have our Lenten Bible study on Wednesday night. And if you missed us um, for this first week, you can certainly feel welcome to come and join us on Wednesday nights at 630. We always have dinner together beforehand. If that works for you, you're welcome to come anytime between five and six ish. So. We're grateful that we can journey together uh, here at University of Presbyterian Church. Our service starts at 10 a.m. and you can join us in person or as always uh, online. So thank you for your attention today and blessings for your Lenten journey.